Let's see what we got here. Healthy choice. Nope, don't want that. Mm, mm, frozen dinner. Don't want that. Want some dessert. Ooh. What's this? Hmm. Hmm. Hudsonville. Fried ice cream. Fried ice cream. How'd they figure out how to get fried ice cream in a quart sized container? Oh well. This will have to do. Leave it to Hudsonville. Anyway, it's time for sweet treats. What's up you guys and welcome to another edition of Sweet Treats right here on the Eddie B's Takeout YouTube channel. I am your host Eddie B. Let's start the show. So um, in case you couldn't tell from the uh, intro to this video or the, the caption, you know the title for the video when I load it on, onto YouTube, um, if you're anything like me you were trying to figure out how in the world did Hudsonville figure out a way to cram fried ice cream into a container like this. This is how they described it. What they did was they have cinnamon ice cream filled with sweet pieces of cinnamon tostada, uh, tostada chips, and swirled with honey caramel, or caramel, however you want to say it. So uh, I'm not going to waste any time. Let's go ahead and get into it, shall we? Okay. You can taste the cinnamon real strong. Let's get one of those, uh, what is that? Uh, sweet pieces of cinnamon tostada chips. So, show you guys the tostada chips. And there's the ice cream. So, mm. That is good. And you know what I like? It says it's swirled with uh, honey caramel. Mm. Regular caramel is just fine to me, but I guess honey caramel takes, takes it to a whole new level. Everything that is blended very nicely in this ice cream. Now, I gotta be honest with you guys, I gotta make a confession. Prior to Hudsonville uh, providing fried ice cream in this format, your boy never had it. That's right, never had fried ice cream before. Um, so I was really trying to figure out like how they would do that. Like, how do you provide fried ice cream in a container? But somehow they did it. So uh, this has been a very uh, good experience for me as a first as a you know a first time uh, introduction to um, fried ice cream. I would have to say I have absolutely nothing else to compare this to. So I would give this a five out of five just because. One, it tastes incredible. It tastes amazing. And now, because I've tried this, let me show you guys again so you can see. Because I've tried the Hudsonville fried ice cream, I am now totally open to trying like real frozen ice, why do I keep saying frozen? Real fried ice cream at a restaurant. Um, not that I wasn't open before, I just never really had the opportunity to try it and it never really appealed to me. Not that it was nasty or anything, I just didn't try it, but now I have. So I want to try the real thing. So Hudsonville, um, you guys are the best. I want to give you guys mad props for your efforts and bringing uh, fried ice cream to life um, to where we can go to our local, whether it's Kroger or Meyer, and get it for ourselves. Um, so I want to encourage you guys, uh, if you have not tried Hudsonville ice cream, um, their ice cream is very delicious. Now you might notice, Typically, Hudsonville has a blue and white label. Uh, same, same writing, but like the backdrop is like blue and white. 
but uh, sometimes they have uh, other special designs for certain times of year. So this is this whole packaging is red and it's got the blue and white label. That's because it's, if I'm not mistaken, it's like a special edition or it's like a limited edition. So I think I actually, my mom got this for the house back in like January. I don't know if it's gonna still be available by the time you guys get around to trying it, but hey, you know, it's worth a shot. Go to your local store, grocery store, wherever you shop and uh, see if they carry it. It's really good. And they have a bajillion different flavors that are both like regular that you can find throughout the year and also um, special limited edition flavors as well. And this fried ice cream being one of them. So that is all the time that I have for this food review. Um, Thank you all so much for tuning in to Sweet Treats, courtesy of the ADB's Takeout YouTube channel. I uh, want to encourage you all to be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And uh, hit me up in the comment section. Show me some love. Uh, give a thumbs up for this review. And also, um, I'll post some information at the end of this video on how uh, you can check out more from the good folks over at Hudsonville. Anyway, uh, that's all I got for today. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. And until next time, take care, God bless, one love.